just going to uh, play a, a collection of my songs um, from my uh, record that's coming out very soon. This song uh, I wrote a few years ago, it's called East Coast. It's about missing uh, the lovely New South Wales and being back in Adelaide again, where I didn't want to be. <laughs> This one um, is a song off of uh, an, an album I released, well, recorded a few years ago. I wrote this song when I was about 21, um, sitting in Glebe, uh, and I had read in the paper that day that this uh, old lady that was just that lived up the road from me had died and wasn't found for a, a few years later in her, in her uh, living room. And I thought it was quite a strange sort of subject for this day and age that somebody had died and no one had found her for, the for two or so years. So uh, yeah, this is called uh, The Sad Life of Elsie Brown. She 
just died alone Let us shade her home And I don't want to end like Elsie Brown No, 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 no So why don't you come around Cause I am sick of no neighbors could chain together I don't want to live like Elsie Brown no 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 you know the sad life Elsie Brown nobody knows nobody knows you know the sad life Elsie Brown Nobody knows Nobody knows her. She must have been there For weeks You said she stayed in All she did was stay, yeah, yeah. And I don't want to live like Elsie Brown, no, 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 no. You know the sad life, Elsie Brown, nobody knows. Ghost in a nest rent for free. The widow wants a gun to vanish everyone. Do you hate us? See, do you love everything? You know the sad life. They'll see brown. Nobody knows. Thank you. Thanks very much. Cheers. Okay. Well, um, I'm just sort of playing it by ear at the moment. I'm kind of a. Uh, I just thought I'd uh, play some of my old songs and play some of the uh, the new ones on the on the record. But um, this next one I'm going to play. 
might just keep it mellow because it's a nice room. And this next one is a song um, that I wrote in January and uh, it's uh, called Light Years. It's all about uh, being with somebody or um, being in a relationship or whatever you, whoever you're friends with or whatever and uh, you know you guys growing apart from each other and uh, not knowing it until you sort of reflect on it one day. This is called Light Years. could be there I lay awake while you're dreaming somewhere so long I wish I could hold on but you light years you light years Light years away, but you're right here. Your light years, your light years away. Understand how we got here. I want to go back again. Right now, I miss my best friend. So long. Wish I could hold on. But your light years, your light years, your light years away. And you're right here, your light years, your light years away. Thank you. Thanks very much.
This song I wrote when I was about 15. This is called uh, Trickster Magic. Thanks very much. I think I've got one more. Is that okay? Yes? One more? I don't know what time it is. I'll be up here all night. Is there one more? Yeah. <laughs> it's weird. I've actually, um, I don't know whether I'm allowed to say this, but anyway, that's me. Um, I've actually got a play over at the NRL launch straight after this. This is kind of strange. I've got the balanced diet. I've got the, uh, the art gallery and then the uh, 
the football across the road. So uh, my uh, new single feels like Woe is actually uh, the, um, the, uh, the, what do you call it, the theme song for this year's football. So it's quite an honour and um, yeah, but um, anyway, back to this gig, sorry. Um, yeah, I'd just like to say, uh, I, uh, I, uh, I don't know, I, I'm going to throw a dedication out for this whole, this whole moment, actually. I've, um, my girlfriend's godfather passed away on the weekend. His, his name was Matt Laffin, and he was an amazing human being, and maybe some of you guys would have heard the, uh, he was, he was such a very strong and, uh, He's just uh, just an amazing. He was one of those guys that you were in the presence of something very special, and uh, he used to love coming here. And um, the first time I met him actually was uh, uh, just in that room over there. And uh, he was a uh, yeah, he was just a, an amazing inspiration to me. And um, you know, so I, he's a. I know he's in here in this room right now. I can feel him. And uh, so I'd just like to uh, dedicate this whole moment, I suppose, to him and. Uh, sending my thoughts wherever he is now and um yeah this last song is um something that he probably would have wanted to hear because he wanted to hear the record but he passed away just as it was getting finished so uh he never got to hear it but hopefully he can hear it now somewhere wherever you are so uh hi matt this is a, a song off my latest uh record that's um that's getting spins on radio at the moment um this is called, this is something I'm about to play over there, but in a very different format. Um, this is called uh, Feels Like Whoa. I hope this works acoustically. This is a bit of a rock out number, but um, you know, anyway, that's enough of me. I'll shut up now. Why do you want? 